right now we are joined with Hunter and Parker over at Wind FM. Happy Thursday. Good morning. Morning. <laughs> Happy. Thursday. Thursday. Happy <laughs> question mark. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Well, like exhausted Thursday. It's been the uh, busy last couple of days. Before we sure get to has. that, we were worried about Idalia maybe messing with some weekend events. Mm -hmm. uh, no, not so much. Tomorrow we've got the Ocala Shrine Rodeo. Oh. And we are giving away tickets for that, I think, this morning at 7.30. So if you listen, you can win. I think. I love it. I think we're giving I them think. away. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> we haven't really looked yet. <laughs> That's happening at the Southeastern Livestock Pavilion. Also, First Friday Art Walk. That's right. Yeah. Today's the last day of August. Tomorrow's the first day of September. And the First Friday Art Walk returns to downtown Ocala. Yeah, so for the next few months through the winter, every first Friday of the month, there's all these different kinds of artists and fun activities for kids and families. And just downtown Ocala really comes to life. So that's cool to check out. Yeah. And we wanted to thank you guys for everything oh. you've done throughout Hurricane Idalia, Mike, you, you, you guys, the meteorology team, mm -hmm. Kristen, everybody else, really. I mean, you guys were all hands on deck, and it's just mm -hmm. amazing the kind of coverage, how extensive and detailed and accurate you guys were. So we just wanted to give you a lot of props. A round of thanks. applause. Good job. That's, nice. that, that, that's very nice. Thank you uh, for saying that. But it's always, and we, we appreciate you guys for, obviously, we appreciate the partnership we have yeah. with you folks over Wind FM and uh, 93.7 K Country who help also to get the information out. Yes. And and things like that but uh, yeah it was crazy because you know being working on this shift uh, which I've done for a while it's usually very quiet it's very a small quiet. group of people who you know are highly skilled and really can get things together and then yesterday <laughs> there were just so many bodies flying about in, in, in the, the newsroom in the studio and the, the bedlam was a little uh, was a bit much at times yeah. but, but given the circumstances yeah. you know you needed to have a lot of people kind mm -hmm. of putting things together and that was a bit of a challenge yesterday to say the least yeah it sure was <laughs> yeah yeah, yeah, a lot of people behind the scenes working. Apparently, I, you guys were incredible. You know, you. we pulled some extra shifts here yeah. as well. And of yeah. course, you know, most importantly, mm -hmm. um, the, you know, how many lives possibly that were saved, mm -hmm. people that got out of the way. And, yep. you know, we certainly hope that, you know, they can get back on their feet. Yeah, you know, a lot of the uh, inland area, Alachua, Marion County, didn't really feel it too much. Like we talked with Dave and Paige yesterday mm -hmm. and they were asking us, you know, what are you guys seeing? so far and at that moment it wasn't really anything heavy but obviously you get further to the Gulf and it's a different yeah. story especially right now Crystal River Steenhatchee our hearts yeah. go out to the people of those communities yeah. so yeah and however we can help we are we are going to be there moving forward because that's what we do yeah, yeah and so you know now so yeah, I was going to say, we're definitely thinking about all the people affected and all the amazing, really the big things goes out to all these utility workers. You know, we've mm -hmm. been seeing yesterday and today, just all of them from Gainesville, Columbia County, Marion County, Dixie County, all these big places um, in Steenhatchee, they're going out and, and helping all the people, cutting trees, cleaning roads, all these things. So they're really the, the heroes in this situation. Absolutely. It's going to take a while to get back to normal. It seemed to be everything, you know, the heaviest, you know, damage and what have you was areas to the west, obviously, along the Gulf Coast and to the north, where there's been a lot of power outages and damage up in our northern viewing area, yes. too. So it's been a, definitely going to be a challenge, but eventually getting back to normal. Yeah. yeah. You know, those are more rural communities, too. Yeah. Cool. And once we get back to normal, how are you going to finally relax? <sighs> what is your one thing? What is What are you guys going to do, like, this weekend when you finally get some time off? Oh, well, I would say bring a whole bag of fast food and <laughs> eat it in my bed and watch a show. <laughs> That's my thing. <laughs> I, I would love to We're do that. We're all piling in bed with Chris. Oh, <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah. Taco Bell. Uh, I would love to do <laughs> yes. that. If, if we didn't have a morning show tomorrow, I would like to do that tonight because the, the Gator game game against Utah is sleep. tonight. I'm still watching. And yeah, I'm still going to watch it too, but uh, yeah. But it, if it was a perfect weekend, tomorrow would be Saturday. It would but be. But it's not. But yes. uh, yeah, looking forward to <laughs> sleeping too. That's one thing. Yes. Gosh, yeah, that's the first thing I said when I walked in today. I'm like, oh gosh, I thought today was Friday. <laughs> yeah, it, it was been Whoops. such a long week. Yeah, mm -hmm. sleep is number one on my list for this mm -hmm. weekend. And just chilling and relaxing. Maybe even yeah. a barbecue. There you mm -hmm. go. Oh, that sounds, sounds pretty nice. Really I have a good buddy of mine who uh, moved to Lakeland, so I'm going to take some time and go uh, take a trip there and see him and hang out Saturday night. So yeah. oh, that'll nice. be nice to, to see a buddy and 
Seeing you two yeah. all safe, not too much affected mm -hmm. by anything is very right. important to us. And we're just, again, thinking about everyone that was impacted and all those utility yep. crews as well. So sure our hearts yeah. go out to, yes. you know, Steenhatchee, Columbia County, um, Cedar all Key, the all counties, those places. Yeah, that, yeah. that dealt with it yesterday. All right. For well, sure. yes. Yeah, you sure. guys have a relaxing you weekend. You deserve it. Yes. All right. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Thank you. And you too. We'll yeah. see you later. See ya. Yeah. You guys take care.